Hockey players are just learning that they've been iced out for the season. The Berkeley rink where they play needs a repair that for now is too expensive to fix. Jason Colthorpe is live and Jason, a lot of teams are, are really scrambling tonight. 10 plus teams, Kim, not counting the recreational ones. And the city for the last two weeks has already spent $60,000 here fixing everything above the ice. And then they realized the problem was beneath it. It wasn't the compressor. And that's when they had to make the tough call to all those teams telling them you're going to have to find somewhere else to play this winter. It's a very devastating day for us. The Berkeley Ice Arena has been a tradition for families since it was built in 1974. Whatever. But many knew this day would come when pipes underneath the concrete floor under the ice finally broke. Which is creating the southwest corner not to freeze. Um, that has that sense spread. It means at least 10 hockey teams plus leagues and open skaters will have to go elsewhere. Some of them have been with us for, for 30 years, unfortunately, that we have to cancel the rest of the winter season, hope we can make the repairs, and then be back up and running in the spring season. It's left teams in a predicament similar to the sheet of ice. That They start calling area rinks and they start trying to find ice and you know scrape and claw because most of those contracts are already set. The hours spent pretty much the last seven days looking for ice has been a nightmare. Paul Fox coaches the Berkeley High School team, which has called this ring home for 17 years. We have five seniors that have put a lot, four years into the program, some of them, and uh, what they're losing out on. We have 11 new kids coming into the program, new families coming into the program, what they're going to be missing out on. There's some rough it also means lost life been. moments. Carl Ullman not only learned to skate here, he watched a very important varsity hockey game here. That basically set my passion to play hockey that moment. It's like an indescribable happiness because you know you're going to go there, you're going to work hard, you're going to try hard, you're going to try to do whatever you can to be the best. And a lot of memories for a lot of families here at this place over the years. Now let's talk cost. It's going to cost the city $100,000 at least to fix this problem. It'll move some money around to make that happen. But everybody that was here at this Parks and Rec meeting tonight knows that's just kicking the can down the road. So of course they brought up building a whole new arena, which would cost three to four million dollars. That would have to be done either with private private investment or a bond issue. The city's going to talk about those possibilities over the next two weeks, but they know they have to make some sort of decision. It's a 42 year old building that was only built to last 25. We're in Berkeley tonight. Jason Coulthorpe, Local 4.